County just got hit hard with some heavy rain, thunder, and lightning. Now those storms are heading for parts of Johnston County. So we will start with the radar that's got a nice workout into this evening. Heavy rain with thunder and lightning just crossing from Wake down into parts of Johnston County. Clayton, you guys getting it southeast parts of Wake County. Going to sweep through parts of Smithfield and Four Oaks again with heavy rain, thunder and lightning, and some gusty winds. It's been 90 minutes though since we've had a severe weather warning. The severe thunderstorm watch has been dropped. The severe threat is much lower, but it's not completely over with tonight. It's almost over with. As you can see, storms moving along the I-95 corridor off to the northeast, and there are still a few showers and thunderstorms south of town as well. These will continue to sweep out in the next two hours before we can sound the all clear, and then we're up tomorrow morning. Dry weather, cooler temperatures. Remember, there's a cold front moving through tonight, so our temperatures will start off cooler in the 50s and by lunchtime will be in the 60s and that's where many of us will stay but this is only the first of two cold fronts this week i'll talk about thursday's cold front and what that's going to bring in less than 15 minutes Wes, we'll see you in just a few minutes. This is a live look at downtown Clayton right now. You can see uh, the rain there that's in the area. No power outages reported right here just yet, but we have seen about 2,600 energy customers without power right now.